Hey guys, what's going on? Troy at Mountain Man Treasure here and this channel all about reselling. It's about going to, at least in the summer, garage sales. And then when those aren't happening, thrift stores, estate sales, sometimes big box stores, wherever, finding stuff that's priced low and then selling it online for a profit. I do that on eBay for the most part, kind of dabble in some of the others time to time, but mostly eBay is the bay. And you know what? It is not garage sale season in Montana anymore. That uh, It lasted a little longer than I thought it would, but it's gone now. It actually snowed here yesterday. No more garage sales. But I do still have some squirreled away from the summer. I've got a memory card of some garage sales, not a ton, but uh, I actually found this one that we're going to show you on my desktop. I downloaded the video and I just never did anything with it. So here you go. It's the lost garage sale. Martin Man. Martin Man. Treasures. Morning. Guys, they're open dark and early, huh? <laughs> kind of in between both. Right? Yeah. yeah. So some folks didn't show up yesterday, huh? Was it yeah, slower than you thought? Way slower. Yeah. yeah. Whatever these have. Are you going to have another sale at some point, or is this it? Like, is there another round coming, or...? This is all different from the yeah. first, except maybe a couple of... Uh, sure, there's going to be some leftovers. Yeah, and they might all be gone. <laughs> <laughs> but is there more that you're going to do later? Or? No. Well, you're... I mean, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I, I know I this is... Do another story here. I don't know. Yeah, I know this is a lot of work. 90s. That thing's cool. <laughs> that guy. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I think the blue will be like two bucks. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I can do that. I think he's super cool. Sure. I took the side off the cast iron just in case you were... Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I think that's... It's super... I don't know where I'm going to put it, but... <laughs> the other one doesn't have the, you know, Rudolph. <laughs> so this guy that got him found an extra reindeer and he added it. Oh good lord it weighs 40 pounds. Did you want these tags? Well. Can I set it up here yeah. or yeah. okay. And we can mire it for the last time. There yeah. you go. I'm gonna make a pile here guys. Oh somebody yeah. found that Santa. Yeah. You guys I have my wife did she find it? Yeah. <laughs> have such cool not... stuff. That guy before. Her aunt was blaming her son. You didn't get it up because it was there. Taiwan, are these rose? No, they're not rust, but they're cool. That one is. Let's see. That's. I like the the Russ. It looks like some of them. Are, this one's an applause, but I like this one. He lost his head, his hair anyway. Keychain. 
Right here. Oh, we're gonna grab Billy. I mean, it's not Mountain Dew, but I love this stuff. I might have to go on the desk. I'm gonna use the, one of these chairs for a pile. Does that work for you? Look, there he is right there, guys. That's Elmer. I'm not gonna say it, but he is. A little chip there. Not a big deal. It's different. Any of this stuff for sale or? All the good stuff on the wall? Yeah. You can ask. <laughs> you can ask, huh? Okay. All right. He probably still doesn't want to get rid of this uh, back glass, does he? Middle guard? Yeah. Yeah, middle guard. I wouldn't blame him. <laughs> yeah. When I first saw it, I was like, middle guard. What is guard? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that Mickey's cool. Probably from, is it night? Maybe 90s? Let's see. I actually like this one. That's a you need, huh? Yeah, we'll just grab this. We'll make a bigger troll pile, why not? I'm here to spend money, right? And I'll keep it going. <laughs> Old Joe Kim. Shouldn't have been awarded to Craig Kuzinski. Wait, but you're Craig Kuzinski. 92. Yes, I am, and I gratefully accept this award. Thank you. For a perfect gift, right. call Renewal by Anderson of Montana. 406-206-9599. Give me a call. If I had any need for a chicken lamp, that is something else. He's coming to uh, Tony McDonald's. She's like, owl. I want the chicken. It's really cool. How about an owl lamp? <laughs> well, I mean, who doesn't that? need that? Crazy. Man. There's another Elmer. Old Homco. Blasted. That's the one that's turned on. That's got the radio playing you now. Oh, there's still some good stuff here, guys. That's pretty cool. I'm missing a leg. I've probably had to do some voiceover in that first one. This can be worth something, but it's pretty beat. So I'm gonna I'm gonna pass, but the Clydesdale models can be good. Alright, what do we got in here? There's an old Bugs Bunny. Mini. 
you see this guy all over. That's an old Ace Novelty Batman. It's like a carnival prize. Like a knockoff Batman. Dirty. Old Seahawks hat. Made in the USA. It's probably a buck, so we'll grab it. Oh, QP. What is that? That's weird. Take one last cruise. Picture here. Yeah. Let's see. Are you selling that? Sure, maybe we could swap. <laughs> I don't have nothing to swap. <laughs> cool. Yeah. What is it? Okay. So there's BD. Oh. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. A little remote, remote control thing. And then uh, Nintendo it's 2DS with the Pokemon. Um, okay. If you're interested. What are you selling? I, I don't know about that guy, but that maybe. What are you looking for? for? I bought it for yeah. 25 bucks. That's probably a fair deal for it. Yeah. Sell it to you for three. It's got, it all works. Do you have it with you here? I don't have no. that one with okay. me. Okay. So yeah, yeah. yeah. I, yeah. I, I do 30 on the DS. Okay. If you give me a call, we can set something up. Okay, cool. Yeah. I think I'm I'm done picking up picking up treasure right, unless unless this young lady's ready she can check out. Oh, no, she's this is her stuff. stuff. Oh, okay. Oh, your stuff. So 16, 17, 67 here. Okay, and then I got these things here. Okay. This. Okay. What'd you say, sixty-seven? Yeah. This. Okay. These guys say five for the okay. set. Okay. I don't know about the bottles. What are those? I used to love this stuff. It had to give, be so terrible for us. I think that had two on it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yep. I'll do that. Okay. There you go. I might have to take a, I'll have to take a couple trips. Yeah, we can just. We can help Which is not a problem. I should have brought my bag in. Well, you know, I, I thought this was all your stuff, so yeah, I can trade. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to buy this, so that's fun. If he's got Santa's reindeer, I'm I'm good. Oh, you bought that, huh? Yeah. Cool. I think it's I think it's really neat. I do too. He's, he is cool. Get out of your way so you can. Carry you pick you pick the heavy one. I appreciate that. Don't drop that. Yeah, the cool stuff there. You know, we we already sold both the Elmers. If you ever find an Elmer, it, grab it. It it sells every time, and some of them are really rare. Some of them sell for quite a lot of money. That one there, the Bud Vase, I'd never found a vase before. And, uh, you know, that it's a very rare piece and uh, sold for very good money. One of those going international as well. So very cool to find two Elmers in the same place. We've sold a handful of those trolls as well. Certainly paid up for those, but a uh, nice guy. I'd been to one of his sales before and he let me come in a little bit early on this one and start looking before other folks got there. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to buy some of those. Um, the, the Billy Bass ended up not working. So that was a bummer, but pick those up if you can get them cheap. They do still sell pretty well. They sell for a higher dollar amount on Amazon, I believe still, but they do still carry some value. Unfortunately, that one just didn't work once I put batteries in it. So, you know, bummer on that. But otherwise, you know, we're making money. That that giant uh, Santa Claus and his reindeer thing, 
I don't know what I'm going to do with that. You know, I, it was too cool to leave behind. It's cast iron, uh, kind of screwed down onto a board. There's no way I'd want to ship that because one it's obviously oversized it's heavy it's a little bit rickety i mean it would take a lot to secure and ship that so that'll eventually be something that i end up selling locally but it was too cool to leave behind so i did pick that up as well and i uh, just really happy to have found some stuff there and cool to find that video to be able to show you guys so now it's time to go and pick our winner for the scale and the Scotty Peelers. They're down there too. Here we go, guys. This again for the scale and the Scotty Peelers. There is the address. We filtered duplicates, including replies, just in case. And we're filtering comments based on a specific text. Remember, you had to say the word new in order to be eligible for this. So let's see how many comments we had. A lot. 139 unique comments fitting that with a new and so now let's pick our winner april hutcherson we're new at reselling not doing too bad now that things are starting to pick up things are definitely picking up we've had some fantastic sales days lately and i hope you have too so april get a hold of me my contact information is down below i need to hear from you so we can get this thing sent out so congratulations. All you got to do, once again, get a hold of me. My email and my Instagram information in the description of this video. And you just got to send me a message and I will get this and the Scotty Peelers sent off to you. But as I said in the last video, we had somebody step up and say, hey, we want to give a newer reseller a scale as well. And so you've also got a scale coming from the Hoogs. That's right, the Hoogs. Who, uh, some of you went over and just helped their channel reach 1,000 subscribers uh, way, way later than they should have reached 1,000. It's such a good channel. Go over there, subscribe to the Hoogs. They're up over 1,000 now. We're not trying to get them over 1,000, but they deserve more and more people subscribe to them. They're very good. The quality of video is there. You're going to like them, I promise you, and you're going to learn. It's going to make your business better. So go subscribe to the Hoogs because actually... It, not just subscribe, you got to watch the videos because after you reach a thousand uh, subscribers, you can get monetized on YouTube once you get enough watch hours. They need to build up those watch hours still. So go over there, watch some of their videos. It helps them, it helps you. This is a win win. And they're, they've been kind enough to join in this scale giveaway. So now let's go select a second winner for a scale from the Hoops. Back for round two, we're going to just hit get comments again if april comes up we'll spin again i didn't filter her out so the scale from the hoogs is going to peanut gallery 187 new congratulations on 10k reselling is a blast and you have some very unique content well thanks so much from the peanut gallery i appreciate that just like you heard before, get a hold of me, Instagram or email. Send me a message. All right, congratulations. Once again, all you got to do is get a hold of me, email, Instagram, get me your information, and I will pass that on to the Hoogs, and they will get you your digital scale. So uh, th thank you guys so much. Uh, and we're, we're now up past 10,000 subscribers, which is so cool to be able to say. And it, it, we're like 30 people past or more now. So the ball just keeps on rolling downhill and it's really cool. We're going to do some giveaways uh, now that we've reached that. We've been doing some working our way up to that, of course, and you know, giving this thing away. But I I've got some more. You know, I, I want to thank you guys for what you've done to support my family, my channel, and my business. So we're, we're going to continue to give some stuff away here in the next little bit so stay tuned lots more stuff coming actually a video coming on friday where i'm going to go into a thrift store 10 bucks and we'll see what we can turn that into you know there's a lot of people that are just starting and they don't have a lot of capital so let's see what i can do with ten dollars cash going into the thrift store i don't know what do you guys think i i, I think i'll be able to make some money you'll have to tune in friday to find out We'll see you guys. Bye.